Today, I'm going to show you how you can set up your Wix action bar in the mobile editor, which you can use to help your visitors contact you instantly from their mobile phones via different channels. What's up you guys, thanks for tuning in with your boy Nino and I got a tutorial for you guys today on how you can set up your Wix quick action bar with plenty of templates to choose from. So let's just get started. All right, so what you guys wanna do is you wanna first go into your mobile editor, okay? Once you get into your mobile editor, you want to come over to mobile tools, click on mobile tools, and then add the quick action bar. And let me just give you a little background about that. So this quick action bar is actually helpful for your visitors to actually contact you via different channels. So that means if you have Facebook down here, if you have a phone contact, an email, a chat box, what have you, a link to your website uh, that is like more important to you, you can actually put more emphasis on that mobile site than you can anywhere else. And I really do appreciate this feature and all that it has to offer, that Wix has to offer. You know how I say it. So uh, you can also create custom links, like I said, uh, to important parts of your site because, I mean, this gives your visitors immediate access to the information that they need. So let's go ahead and get started with just these four simple setup quick actions right here. So you first got the phone, all right? You have your email, you have your Facebook, and then you have your chat. Now chat is automatically uh, put on there because of having Wix chat already uh, onto this site. So if you wanna get rid of that, you just have to get rid of uh, the Wix chat and then that will then uh, make this chat box go away. Now I will say that uh, for each one of these you have to set them up so you'll have to go here you have to click setup. All right once you click setup then you can add your phone number here. So that's just a little quick thing to do as well as with your email you can do that same here and you can add a little catchy subject line so that they act so you actually know where you're customer or visitor is coming from. Uh, and that is, they may be coming from the mobile mobile site uh, contact. Okay, and then you'll just put your email uh, and there you go. So we got your email and all you have to do is click done. So boom, that notification goes away that I have completed that whole thing and now is up and running for me to use. Okay, so now if you guys wanna actually set up more quick action uh, buttons, you just go here to uh, your quick actions here. Okay, and then you click more actions, all right? These give you a wide range of actions that you can actually have on your website. What I really do like about this is that you can actually add a contact form here. And that is a game changer because now all you can do is click that and it brings you up to a contact form. And it's very useful, it's very handy. Also, you can do the address, you can do WhatsApp. If you have a WhatsApp uh, uh, phone number, uh, you can do your email and what have you. So definitely get creative with this and I just support anything that you guys do in terms of getting your visitors into the right place for your site or even to the right place for your different channels. I fully support that. It's pretty cool actually. All right, so once you have finished that and you picked which one you wanted, like I will say, let's go ahead and pick WhatsApp. All right, once you have the WhatsApp, you can go through the setup again here and then you can add your number this way, okay? Now, I want to take this off, so all I have to do is click here to remove, all right? And then I immediately removed it off of my quick action bar. 
Now I'm gonna remove Facebook and I'm gonna remove phone number. Now what you can actually do here is actually you can set up the way the settings are. So let's go ahead and look into the settings. Now if you want these things to show their labels, all you have to do is click yes, all right? And then it'll show its labels here. I think that it's intuitive for people to know that this means email and this means chat. So I'm not going to keep the labels right there. Now you have the layout here where you can have it on the right or left. So you can just go ahead and pick however you choose. You can also design it. They give you customized templates here, which I definitely advise everyone to use. But if you don't want to and you want to actually get it in in uh, sync with your site and your site colors, then I suggest that you guys go to customize that design, which I'm just going to go ahead and put it right here. And then I'm going to click customize design just to show you guys how it would look. So what you can do here is you can do an invert color scheme uh, with the color here or a grayscale or a black and white. OK, I choose to go with the color and then you can look at the different inverted color schemes. So that is the color white and then you have the color there for the specific item. And then you can actually go ahead and put that color inverted out. All right. Now, what you guys can do here is actually add a border style, which you can do that. And you can see that it's giving me a nice little border right inside of my quick action bar. All right. Also, you can add a little bit of shadow. I don't really want to do that right now, but you can actually do that here. It's just like other customized designs on Wix that they give you here. All right, and so I think that is almost about it. Uh, yes, Notorious Wix help, that's right there. So I guess that's about it. I mean, that is basically all you need to know in terms of making it look good. Now, I will just go ahead and preview this thing. All right, so let's go ahead and hit preview. And boom. Now I have my email set up right here and then I have my chat box set up here. Looking pretty good, Amanda. Yeah. All right. Awesome. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Definitely give it a shot. If you have any questions, drop it below in the comments section. Okay. Thank you so much for watching guys. And if you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll see you in the next video guys. All right, ciao.